way to spread the holiday cheer than with some fantastic Christmas ideas for your children. Hello everyone and welcome to my new series, The Christmas Gift Guide idea series and this is the first video of the series in the next three or four wednesdays i'll be sharing christmas gift ideas gearing towards seven and up uh, age range it will be mostly smart games or in the stem category so if you are interested in that kind of content be sure you are subscribed and hit that notification bell so that every time I will post a new video, you will be notified. I am especially thrilled to share these gift ideas with you because we know how hard it is sometimes to find the right present for that particular person or child. Something that will create a long and lasting memories and that will bring joy to our children. What a joy to see those smiling faces on Christmas morning while they are opening their presents. I know Christmas is not about presents, it's about the birth of Jesus, but it's like a tradition already that we give presents to our children. So without further ado, let's jump right into the magic of Christmas gift ideas. The first thing that I have for you is this Grizzly Gears game. Timber Dodo has sent me this to review. Look how Christmassy it is. My children loved playing this one during free time. This is a one player puzzle game and this is for ages 7 to adult. There are 80 ways to play or to solve the puzzle. How awesome is that? I am going to leave a link in the description box down below for you guys and be sure to check it out. It comes with a little booklet. Uh, this has the instructions and the solutions. There are four levels of difficulty, starter, junior, expert, and master. The starter level has 12 ways to solve the puzzle. The junior level has 28 ways to play. The expert has 20 ways and the master has also 20 ways to play. So overall, there are 80 ways to play this one game, one puzzle game, but there are 80 ways. That's a lot of fun and you will get your money's worth. Each piece is also durable and very sturdy. My children love playing this in our car rides. So it's really worth checking, guys. This will be a great addition to your game collection. The object of the game is to move each character to its end position. Characters are moved by rotating the tree pieces Yay! these are the three pieces that are meant to go here those are the loose pieces right yeah this one the girl goes to her tent yeah and then the chopper he goes to chop the logs and then the beaver goes to the swamp and then these three pieces, they go here. The, mama, the baby bear goes here. And then the baby bear goes, I mean baby, the brother rabbit goes here. And then the baby reindeer goes here. None of the, ba none of the pieces can go here except for the baby bear. Because if they go here, they get locked. Because you can see there's a gap. When you start, the game. They tell you what order to put the pieces in. So the piece, the order of the pieces aren't always the same. So if I start from the mama bear. There. See, in the first level, you put the baby bear here. In the, in the game, 
see the baby bears facing this way? Yes. Just because he can. He can move forward and he can move backward, even though he's only facing this way. Okay. So, in the first level, this is pretty easy because, look, you can see that you have to move this, then you can move this, then you can move this, and then you can move it. And, ta-da! That was quick. Mm -hmm. Because that was in the first, that was in the first level. There's a junior one with a bear and then there's a beaver. The beaver starts at the tent. The baby bear, he starts, he starts here. He's pretty close to the mama bear. But I'm feeling like I don't think you should move in there already. I think he, he th this beaver is close to where, to his goal in this water. You can move this, but you cannot move this. It's locked. Oh, John. So this is number 41. Mm -hmm. Number 41 is the first level in expert. The goal is to take these three characters and to put them to their home base. It's, oh. That's exactly what it means. So the, the rain, this baby reindeer would go to the mama reindeer. He would go to chop wood and she would go to her tent. And they're the same color too. So well, this one... I don't know why, but it would just do this. I don't feel like that's a trap because it still gives him the space so he can still move. But I would do this because if you want him to get here, you have to like, mm, but that's tricky. That's tricky, how do I? So if I did this, the reason why I do these things is because they give me, this hole allows me to make this still be able to move. But if I put him here, then I put him here, there wouldn't be a hole up here anymore. That's why I do that. This is very hard on this level. Okay. And once you mix it up, it's pretty hard to get it back the way it was. Back like this. Okay, I can take him. Oh, oh here. I can take him here. I can take him here. Then I can take him here, and then I can move the right here. Oh, that's getting. I believe that's all I have for you today. Please don't forget to hit that notification bell or if you have not subscribed yet, subscribe and see you next Wednesday. Bye!